this is the big brother to the baster. This is the basomatic. Uh, as you can see, it's taller, um, and it is an actual three-way speaker system. So it has a 10-inch woofer on the bottom end, on the, on the bottom here. That's a 10-inch woofer to handle the low end. And then it has an 8-inch driver with a coaxial driver mounted on here. So anyways, construction-wise, it's about the same as the baster. Uh, relatively lightweight, it's 30 pounds, so it has a handle right up here on the top. So again, very maneuverable and carryable, although it's a little heavier than the other one, but uh, still it, just a great package. It's a small footprint, which I really like, so if you're in a small stage setting where you know we usually find ourselves, uh, it doesn't take up too much room. So here's the side, it's deep. Um, and it, uh, it definitely will uh, handle low end and emit that low end. It's very nice. The back of the cab, uh, almost the same as the baster. It has uh, two speak on, um, speak on inputs. That is the basomatic three-way system. Again, these are ISI cabinets, and now we'll do a little playing. Okay, guys, so now I'm with the basomatic. Whoops. <laughs> the basomatic, it's the, uh, the three-way uh, cabinet. So it's very nice and uh, it's a very full sound. Also, so they uh, they respond very well to the volume that I'm playing and the inflections that I'm playing. cabinets they definitely um, pack some volume and tone very great tone <laughs> another thing I should mention too is that I had no problem um, being heard <laughs> uh, over a loud band a, a three or four piece band and um, Mark Cohen, the uh, owner of the company, says that two of these uh, definitely rival a 410 cab, and I can uh, I can definitely see that. Thank mm -hmm. you. 